Welcome to this video on quickly adding a sequence of numbers in Microsoft Excel. So I've got a table here and I'm going to, I need numbers 0 to 50 and I'm going to put some information next to those or maybe just pull it in from another source. But I need the numbers 1 to 50 in a column, in column A going down. Now I can obviously start typing these in and dragging them down but there is another quicker way to do this. And it's actually by using a function called sequence. So you may know if I keep just typing these in, let's just show you how it works and then pull that down. I can drop it in there, change that and fill the series and it will keep doing it and I can figure it out up until 50. Or if I just get rid of all of that, let me show you the function that works really, really nicely. So rather than having one in there, I'm going to put the equal sign because remember you start a function or a formula always with equals and then I'm going to put sequence, so S-E-Q and double click on that one so it opens it up for me. And then I'm just going to put the maximum number. So I want 50, I want 1 to 50, so I'm going to put 50 in there, close the brackets and press enter. And you can see there it's dropped it down for me all the way, if I scroll down, all the way to 50 really nicely, really easy for me to work out with. And now all I've done there is use the function equals sequence. You can obviously change whatever number you want and that just works really nicely if you want to add sequential numbers in a column all the way down and do it quickly and easily without having to try and fill a series and work out which cell you're going to or not. Use the equals sequence, sequence function. It's a bit of a mouthful to get out there but a really, really, really useful function that you might want to be aware of. So one to have a play around with, see if that one works for you when you're working with Excel and showcase your skills so you can be super productive. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and do let me know in the comments what videos you'd like me to record next.